long ago, the Traveler came to the Soul System. It brought a golden age to humanity. They explored, they built, they thrived. Until the collapse. A terrible calamity caused by the Traveler's oldest enemy. It brought the people of Seoul to the brink of extinction. When all hope seemed lost, the Traveler saved humanity by creating us. With the Traveler's light, ghosts and guardians together protected the last city from the forces of darkness, no matter the cost. But we soon learned even that was more complicated than we thought. Our enemies wielded the light, shaking our faith in what we once thought we knew. From old conflicts grew new alliances. And just as our enemies learned to wield the light, we found a way to leverage the darkness. In that darkness, we rediscovered the beam responsible for humanity's collapse. The witness. It wishes to create what it calls the final shape. Our universe perfected in the name of salvation. Everything calcified into eternity. We've tried to follow the witness into the Traveler, and every attempt has failed. Until now. Vanguard Scout Crow wished his way inside. The paracausal bond he shares with his twin sister will guide us safely through. Now, our leaders prepare a strike force to enter the Traveler, to confront the Witness. That's our role, the tip of the spear. Every battle we fought has brought us to here and now. It's time. for you.
The witness nears the final shape. We're initiating Operation Ahamkara. Now. The Traveler cannot abate it much longer. The portal is unstable. Ikora, the Guardian. Me. I won't lose another soldier in this war. If it is, it was an honor to serve the last city with you. This was the old Vanguard Command Center, but it's changed. Light and dark are welling up here, more than I've ever felt before. It feels like... like you could reach out and pull all that power to you. Control it. Could you? The line between light and dark is 
It's gone. It, it's gone. Guardian, you're... You fused light and dark into harmony. How? Thanks. So, what's next? We're outmatched. We're alone, and... And... What is that noise? It's coming from over there. Uh, you gotta get better boots, Crow. I could hear you coming a mile away. Now Aldrin, <laughs> he could sneak up on a fella. You're not Crow. Well, I'll be damned. Cade? How long has it been? A lifetime. The kid told me a few guns were on their way. Said the Vanguard would send their best. Real good to see you two. I finally have someone to talk to about Crow's stupid haircut. Come on, I'm guessing you have questions. And I won't say I have answers, but let's talk. I like Crow's haircut. start. I died. You probably remember that. Not great. Partly my fault. Lesson learned. Let's not dwell. And after that, nothing. But not a bad nothing. A peaceful nothing. I think I felt her there too. My ghost. Sundance. She was part of me. Or I was part of her. Like we were two cards shuffled back into our deck, whole again. And then there was... Oh, there was... Pain. Separation. Something pulling me out. I woke up here, in this body, alone. No ghost. No way to use the light. And what could make this traumatic experience better than finding my killer waiting for me? But we talked it out because we're adults. He seems nicer these days. Yeah, pretty low bar, I'll admit. Because we got bigger problems. Bigger, weirder problems. Crow said this was all inside the Traveler, but I already knew. It's in pain. Pain I can feel. Somebody's up in that monolith with their hand on a knife. Crow calls it the witness. And what it's doing out here has a name too. The final shape. It's the end of everything. said it already but it is good to see you just wish it were under better circumstances it's it's good to see you too Kate I never thought hey it's all right I get it this is a lot and as much as we both want to catch up we ain't got that kind of time yet we got to get out there and find crow 
I was expecting him, not you, and that ain't a good sign. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. We can save the celebrations for later. Guardian, we should... Can we talk for a minute first? Just you and me? I'll give you two some privacy. Last I heard from the kid, he was out on patrol. Called in some sort of darkness anomaly. I'll scout ahead. Catch up with me when you're ready. There. Up ahead. Crow. Crow? Quiet. Listen. I've seen these veiled statues before. You have too. It's whispering something, but I can't quite make it out. Stop listening to it! I told you to wait outside. This place is... I don't know what kind of effect it's going to have on you. He's right, Glint. I don't care. He doesn't get to make those decisions for me. We're supposed to be a team. Guardian and Ghost. That's how the Traveler made us. I'm sorry. Don't ever leave me behind again. Promise. I promise. Let's set up camp outside. Kate's not far. Of course he isn't. Tell me you got the drop on him at least. You and the Guardian both need better boots. Well, maybe I'll get lucky this time. It's hard to describe. It's like... These pockets of darkness are physical manifestations of the witness's presence here. An infection, festering. You said it spoke to you. In the dark, tempting me. The witness knows what's in our hearts and minds. It promises to make it all real as part of the final shape. Listen, whatever the witness is doing to the Traveler, our ghosts can feel it too. And it's spreading. Ikora would know what to do. Oh, don't worry, kid. We'll find her. Even if we have to blast our way through. I don't think it's that simple. Sometimes it can be. Let's just... Get our bearings again. Refocus. Agreed. We found Ikora. She's deep in meditation. If Ikora zenned out, she might actually get some answers from the Traveler. Thank you, Guardian. I thought that maybe here... Maybe the Traveler might give me some sort of guidance, as it once did for the Speaker. I closed my eyes and I opened my heart and mind. I think I heard it... screaming. So did we, when we came through the portal. This place... We know. The witness infecting the Traveler. Darkness combined with light. I wish Osiris could see it. He was always ready with a hypothesis. But here's mine. The Witness brought darkness into the Traveler. Everything you see here inside it is a physical manifestation of a thought made real by the light. Your thoughts. Mine. The Witnesses. It plans to weaponize that light. Reshaping reality outside the Traveler into a perfect stillness. 
A great silence. Never changing. Never dying. Imagine your greatest triumph. Or your most profound regret. Immortalized as a part of a universe where nothing exists except by the witness's consent. It chooses what your eternity will be, and imprisons you safely inside it. This is its promised salvation. This is the final shape. The witness sees itself as the god it wishes the Traveler was. And although the Traveler resists the Witness's corruption, it and everything we know will eventually succumb. I always warn Zavala not to put all his faith in the Traveler, to save some for the rest of us. But maybe faith in the Traveler is exactly what we need. If light is powerful enough to destroy the universe, then light is powerful enough to destroy the witness. Come back safe. So, is there anyone else with you? Not Commander Zavala, I assume. This isn't quite up to his standards. Hey. I did my best, all right? Given the circumstances, I think Big Blue will forgive me. Will you? No. It's too much. It's just too much. It's one thing for the witness to look in our hearts and minds, to conjure up our memories, but this. Hey, Cora, come on, look at me. I see you. I know this is hard. It's tough for me, too. Tough? What do you know about tough? You are always running off to play renegade, leaving me and Zavala to shoulder all the responsibility when... when we were supposed to be a team. I know. I'm gonna make it up to you. I know you like me. Don't get ahead of yourself. You still have a lot to make up. Well then, we better get started. I used to think I'd give anything to bring you back. But when the Witness offered me an eternity here with you... ...with our son... ...I know you understand why I refused. There are people who... ...still need me. Soon. Safi, I'm sorry. Eyes up, Commander. It's a lie. The witness shows us what it thinks we want. And what has the Traveler shown me? <sighs> we should go.
I know. I loved them too. I don't know how you're here. But... Uh, yeah, me too, big guy. <sighs> me too. And I thought we lost her when her ship went down. But she's tougher than that. She soldiered on. She... She... Losing Amanda was like losing you all over again. I'm done burying my friends. Life isn't about holding on forever. I mean, I was gone, born at peace, and now I'm here, opening old wounds, filling them with salt. And eventually, you have to let go. wants to talk about how wonderful it is that the Traveler brought me back, like Ikora hasn't done enough of that already. It wasn't the Traveler. It was me. I wished my way here on an Ahamkara. On an Ahamkara? The dragon that twists wishes and dreams into waking nightmares? What the hell made you think that was a good idea? We were out of options. I remember thinking that I wanted to do this because I had to make things right. And just before I took the plunge, I remember thinking about the Great Cade Six. No light, no ghost, fearlessly staring up at me from the wrong side of his own gun. And there you were. And there I was. I should have told you sooner. No. No, you did the right thing keeping this between us. Ikora and Zavala can't know the truth. Not right now. They need faith. Right. And I need a drink. You go on, Guardian. We'll catch up. Something's changed in the Guardian. New power. I can feel it. The Traveler can give us all the weapons it wants, but without a plan on how to use them, we're as good as dead. 
worse. But we can't overlook the fact that it is helping us. Directly. It gave us Cade. And it's not enough. When I was... at my family's homestead, something reached out. A voice. A new voice. Calling to me. Trying to get my attention. That wasn't your wife. I know. It was a statue draped in a veil. A relic of the witness. What are you suggesting? You've seen the witness. You know what it wants to do to us. Maybe it's imprisoned others like that. No. It's a trick, Zavala. The witness is weaponizing your grief and desperation against you. What do you know about grief and desperation? Except how to turn it off. That's not fair. Listen, Commander. Cade thinks we still might be able to get insight from the Traveler. Commune with it, like Ikora was trying to. The Guardian received a vision before. Maybe they will again. Cade's out there right now, looking for a way. And when that fails... Then we'll think of something else. I don't hear anything. Mind if I try? Oh. What is it? It's, uh... It's a child's voice. Are you serious? Yeah, no, it's... It's whispering something. Crow. Crow. Why did you murder the handsomest hunter in Seoul? <laughs> Bastard. Whoa, whoa, wait, wait, wait. You hear that? Come on, knock it off. No, I'm serious this time. No, I... <gasps> Tenants. Hi. Sontes? Is that really you? I'm what you wanted me to be. <sighs> I don't understand. I know. 
You've been here before. You won't be here again. You just don't remember. You can't. What comes from the light returns to the light. Well, what if what I want is to stay here? With you? If that's the fate you make. But you're always with me, Cade. Guardians, ghosts, the Traveler. We're all connected. We are... Devotion, bravery, sacrifice. The Guardian Tenants, I, I... I know. I... I know, I know, I heard you the first time, but you forgot one. It's... <laughs> no! 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 What happened? What did you say? Don't touch me! Don't! Don't touch me! Don't! No! Excellent work. Answers are finally within our reach. Give yourself to darkness. Zavala, this is reckless. And that's coming from me. You're not just going to let him do this, are No you? one lets me do anything. I am Vanguard Commander, and you will follow my orders. And we're your friends. We can find another way. The Traveler... The Traveler can't help us. It could never help us. I gave it everything I had. And it keeps taking. You have us. You have Kate back. Your fire team. That's not enough.
I see what you are. What do you see? I see fear. Taj, no! We have done away with fear. We are not afraid. <laughs> yes, you are. Changes nothing, Zavala. You're still our friend. You're still our commander. It changes everything. I have no light. No purpose. No ghost. Look, I know you want to blame yourself, but Tars knew what he was getting into. Don't. Please. I was prepared to pay any cost. I was. Not Taj. He was devoted. He was brave. And part of me resented him for that. Sometimes I wished he would just... Leave me. To rot in peace. Well, he did what ghosts are supposed to do, right? He recruited you for a war. And he chose to sacrifice himself so you could end it. End it? How? I threw away my light for a riddle and a memory. A memory that can save us all, of the witness becoming what it is. What was made... ...can be unmade. Right, right! Oh, we, we gotta link up with those Defector Spectres again. The place they showed me... It's here. The witnesses' memories became manifest, too. I can guide us. But... I'll need help. We can do that. Alrighty then. We keep our momentum and Zavala gets to focus on something that's not... You know, we ask a lot of our ghosts. And they don't get one second chance, much less the million that we do. Just wish I'd thank my gal Sundance back when... I could. But she knew I appreciated her. At least I hope.
is not yet lost. The Witness may have won this battle, but it is wounded. And while you've been occupied here, within the Traveler's heart, I've brought our allies to help you land the final blow. The full might of Keitel's Empire stands behind us in this endeavor. Mizrax Kel rallies his House of Light to save their great machine. And I have found a guardian of great renown, Micah Tim, who comes to us with bold ideas. If you intend to subdue the Witness, we must first fight its corruption and weaken its hold on the Traveler. You will grow in strength, in power, and when the Reckoning is at last upon us, you will storm the Witness's monolith and strike where it is most vulnerable. You will shatter its hold on the Traveler, and you will End it. While well, your calculations are cooking, pull up a chair. Something I gotta talk to you about. You know, between us, I think part of me always knew it wasn't the Traveler that brought me back. I ain't that special. That's not true. Ikora needs you. Zavala needs you. Your hunters need you. No, that's the thing. See, I'm not sure they do anymore. I'll tell you a secret. I'm not always so sure I have one either. A purpose. I tell myself I was chosen for a reason, but... We all crave meaning, Cade. That's just life, no matter who or what gave it to you. Do whatever you want with it. Huh. Thanks, kid. Nice work out there, Guardian. Cade has his own way of doing things. I respect that. He might not think he's special, but he's got a special something. The type of heroism that doesn't typically lead to a line of succession. It's why the hunters were so loyal to him, why many still are. It's why the Vanguard is still incomplete. Why you hunted down Aldrin. Get some rest, Guardian. I'll stand watch and let you know when Kate calls in. I know you still hate me deep down, but we should probably stick together from now on. I don't hate you. I don't even hate Aldrin. We both played our hands in his trump mine. It cost me my life, my friends, Sundance. Oh man, Sundance. She was everything. But, I got dealt the new hand, and get to choose how I play it next. Cade, I need you to know I'm sorry. All of me. Everybody makes mistakes, kid. And everybody, I mean everybody, pays for them. Don't you think we both paid enough? Yeah. Definitely has a smell, but I do see a gross bit I could use for.
pretty good idea. Thanks. I have those sometimes. I don't understand. It's a new cloak. If you're going to be the next Hunter Vanguard, you'll need one. The Vanguard Dare isn't law. If it was, Aldrin would have the position. But none of that matters. This needs to be your choice. If you don't want it, or you're not ready, don't do it. I wasn't ready, but I did the best I could. But you're the Hunter Vanguard. Not anymore. Too much paperwork. Look, you want purpose. This is it, kid. Me, I can't be tied to a desk if I'm gonna find mine. Just think about it. I dare you. I will. Make sure you celebrate, yeah? Life's still all about that timing, huh? Big fight coming up. Let's get to it. Hey! Good job dodging the Vanguard gig. That's why you're one of my favorites. the witness's monolith and shattered its hold on the traveler's light. Their courage bought us one last chance to finish this. But the witness still lives. The guardians and their ghosts will face the witness while we eliminate the remainder of its forces. Our final chance at freedom lies on that field. This enemy has taken so much from us all. Elixni. Cabal. Awoken. Humanity. I've. The Witness started this war long ago. But now, we end it. was made can be unmade. I know what to do. Guardian, channel the Traveler's light through me. I'm ready.
I... I don't understand. That's it. We did it. We... We did it. One ghost. He sure shine bright back there, huh? Kate. What comes from the light returns to the light. My gal Sundance told me that. She also said we're all connected. Guardians, ghosts, the Traveler. Now you tell the others this was my choice. My light. Nobody makes my fate but me. You're my favorite. Don't ever forget that. Guardian. There you are. Definitely healing, but we've still got a lot of work to do. Surviving witness forces, clashes with the Lucent Brood. celebrated it yet. Guardian, ghost, you're just in time. Tell them Cade wouldn't let a little work get in the way of having a good time. <laughs> you're right. For now, our task is appreciating this moment. And after that?
will face the future when it comes.
witness's death spread like a shockwave through its troops. The instant it was destroyed, things shifted. Most of the witness's followers fled when it fell, but its most zealous believers are still carrying out its last orders. Zivu Arath is still out there, mortal, moving in the shadows. How salvation is turned on itself, with Aramis nowhere to be seen. Savathun and the Lucent Brood are trying to claim control of the Pale Heart. But the witness dead, both Scorn and Taken are directionless. To put it simply, in the wake of the witness, a power vacuum has been created in the universe. Who knows what will try to fill it. But out of all of this, the most worrying thing is an aurora. It's bleeding out of the Traveler. Light and darkness venting into open space over Earth. We designated a no-fly zone within 100 kilometers of the Aurora, enforced by Alliance cruisers. So far, no one has tested it. During the initial formation of the Aurora, a piece of anomalous matter erupted from the Traveler, moving away at relativistic speeds. We tracked one out to a distance between Neptune and Jupiter, in the orbital path of Nessus. Then we lost track of it. I've got hunters in the field investigating. Thank you, Crow. I'll leave it to you. Copy that. I'm headed back out to the field myself. I... need to see if I can pick up Fickrell's trail. Find out what's going on with the Scorn. Keep me updated. And... good work. <laughs>